What up, YouTube? It's your boy, Hustle Q, man. Check this out, man. It's Friday. Some of us got jobs and some of us don't. But we about to do this, man. We about to hit a yard sale, man. Um, if you watched the last couple of videos or whatever, man, it was a yard sale fail. Um, it's Friday. You might not see this video till Monday or Tuesday, man. Um, got a lot of things going on. Anyway, let's get into it, man. Let's do what you got to do. And this is my thing hanging down, so don't get it twisted. I ain't got something hanging from my ear. Well, actually, I do. But anyway, let's go, man. Let's go. <laughs> All right, YouTube, just came out of this yard sale. You saw a little footage on it right now. They didn't have much. Um, the one thing, hustle and motivate, remember that. All right, the one thing, the only thing I saw, if you notice, I kind of put the camera on it, was those Healy shoes, he Healy's, Healy shoes. The comps on it were like people selling out of different states, man, 60, 70 some dollars, brand new though. These look brand new, the shoestring bag, it looked like they haven't been worn, maybe just throwing around a couple of had a couple of scratch you know scratch marks Not, nothing bad though but the problem was it was missing the damn wheels come on man so anyway she wanted 10 bucks for them and i'm looking she said check amazon for the wheels 25 bucks for a set of wheels man 10 bucks 35 what was that 25 35 you know i do get free shipping but 35 dollars for the shoes and the wheels man wasn't worth it anyway on to the next yard sale man we gotta do this man we gotta find something god dang it all right, peace. Let's go. Hello. Hi, YouTube. So check it out, man. Hit a yard sale, hit a couple more yard sales. Um, I couldn't film because there was people coming and I had to start scanning stuff to make sure. Now this one lady talked me into buying this ice cream maker on one of the yard sales. And um, I really didn't want it, but she caught my attention on it, man. Excuse me if the light's in the way, y'all. Let me see if I get that out the way. No, nope. all right, so we don't deal like this. So anyway, um, hit a couple more yard sales, found some good stuff. I gotta tell you, man, this yard sale was better. I hit three yard sales total. Um, got some video games. When I head back to the house, had to stop at Joins real quick, pick up some shirts for a short order. Uh, short order I got to do. And uh, what else? What else? What else? That's it, man. We're gonna head back to the house. 
I'm going to show you everything I got. And I did get ice cream maker. Yes, I did get ice cream maker. I, I, I don't know why, though, but I kind of wanted to make some ice cream because I never made ice cream before. Then I might sell it. I might keep it. But if ice cream turned good, but it's used. So I got to clean it up really good. But anyway, let's head back. Um, show you what we got. This lady was giving away some stuff. I got a quick story to tell you, though. Um, real quick. You know what? We'll wait till we get back. All right, let's go. All right, YouTube. What's up, man? We're back for the yard sales. I'm going to go over everything I got. Not much, man, but it's a little something, man. It was definitely better than the last yard sale I went to. But I did think I made a bad buy. I spent $4 on it. Um, it's an ice cream maker, man. So look, it's $4 right there. Um, it's got everything with it. You know, all the utensils. I looked up some comps real quick before I bought it. And um, it was some good comps. But I put pre-owned. And I saw pre-owned open box, but the comps that I saw, I noticed people still had it like kind of wrapped up, like it was never used, but it was pre-owned, but never used. So I don't know if this was a bad buy or not. I kind of wanted to try it out to make some ice cream, but I don't know if it's like for me to use it. Like, I mean, I have to clean it, of course, and see, I don't know. Either I'm going to keep it, I'm going to clean it hella good figure out how to use it there's no manual but i'm pretty sure it's kind of self-explanatory to use this but this could have been a bad purchase anyway it was four dollars it's got everything with it just no box and every comp that i saw some person had an open box they had them they had an open box but they still had the plastic around it like it's never been open so anyway i don't know man we'll figure it out man we'll see what's up maybe we'll put it on offer up or something i don't know man four dollars though it's my investment okay let me go to the next one real quick man um, the next year, next one of the, I'm gonna skip a yard sale. I went to three yard sales total. Okay, one of them was a drag. I told you about the Heelys and everything. That was the one that was nothing. Um, this one yard sale I went to, I picked up this one right here. Um, actually, this this is where I got the ice cream maker. I went back and I saw this right here. Um, I will post up the comps that I saw on this one. It was any. Uh, let me see. The comps was going from like um, that little cheat sheet here. The comps was going for like 20 plus on this on this plush, but it was only a couple, I believe. Um, going like 20 bucks. The lady said, just give me a dollar for it. So I bought the ice cream maker for four and this one for a dollar. So that was five bucks right there. So um, let me see what we can do with this thing right here. It's the Mohawk Monster Truck, Monster Jam, like that. I can get something for it, man. Make back my $4, right? And plus that. So this other yard sale i went to and here's a trip though all right i went to three yard sale there was only three in my area and i had to get back because i gotta do a lot of shipping and stuff like that the crazy part is this lady that had the stuff she has just sold a sega genesis console i just missed it but anyway i'm going through her stuff and this is one of the things i saw which i got to test it out i got the adapter to test it out it's a pac-man game i'll post up the comps i saw in here i don't know if it was um it was um sold comps for like 25 bucks recent. It was a recent comp. So I might can get something out of this. Now she wanted five dollars for this thing. Now I'm taking a chance with it because I don't know if it works or not. She says it does. So I saw it. Cool. Then I picked up this one. This is the same yard sale. Then I picked up this right here. This one right here, um, it has comps from 15 to 20 bucks or so, like that. You know, it's just all over. It's I mean it's new. Um, little wear on the corners and everything, you know, I'll put all that in the description, but it's sealed and everything, which is cool. This next one I got right here. This is the same yard sale. Um, it's a Harry Potter. Um, I don't know. I forgot. It's a Harry Potter training stick or something like that, man. Anyway, I saw so comps anywhere from 10 to 15 to $20, different ones. Um, a lot of them are listed and batteries might be dead inside. So can't really, I don't want to open it up. Look like it might have been open. I'm gonna double check to see. I mean, it's got wear around here. It might have been open, but the little straps inside are still attached. So maybe if I can get in there, maybe put a battery in there. I don't know. If not, that's cool. But they have some pretty good comps on those three items. Now, trip real quick. True story. Me and the lady got to talking, right? We was just talking. She was trying to send me a Harley Davidson hat. You'll see it in the um, I think I put it on video. Um, but I didn't have no use for it. it had scratches on it and I wanted it but she wanted 20 bucks for it but it had scratches on it and whatnot so anyway I grabbed those three things we got to talking about insurance we got to talk about jobs and layoffs and insurance blah 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 and I was telling her how my job insurance was like $350 per week just for medical for me and my family and I was like ridiculous right $350 a week and like my supervisor used to get mad at me like how come you're not getting insurance 
It's like your insurance is too freaking high, bro. Shit, I don't make the money like you. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, she was telling us, man, that's crazy. Like that. She's how many kids you got? I, was like, I got a total of five kids, y'all. By the way, if y'all didn't know, I got five kids. One's already grown and everything and gone on her own. Um, I got my four little ones that's with me right here like that. So I told my family of six like that. So we got the yippity yapping and everything, man. About five minutes later, um, I was looking at the book. She had a grip of books that I, they looked very interesting. And I wanted to look at the books. And then um, I said, well, look, let me go ahead and pay for this. Now, she wanted five for this. She wanted $2 for this and $2 for that. But no, today I was setting a budget. $10 is all I was going to spend. I wasn't spending no more money, man. 10 bucks. I got a gang of stuff right now. So spending 10 bucks was my budget. Now, before I got the cough, this is before I got the um, the ice cream maker and the monster truck. I went to this yard sale before that. Anyway, so this was five bucks. That was two. So I'm looking at $9. I'm saying, you know what? That's it. I'm done. I'm done. This is $9. I'm going to go home after this, right? Man, this lady must have felt bad for me. I'm thinking she must have saw my other video, the yard sale. She's like, you know what? I want you to take it. And I was like, no, 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 no. Let me give you something for this. Like that. She said, nope, take it. Let your kids enjoy it. Now, on one side of me, I felt bad because I'm like, lady, I'm about to sell this stuff. You know what I'm saying? But she insisted that I took it. And I don't know if it was the insurance thing, but I told her I, I got my wife insurance and we have a, a better insurance like that. But I told her the price of my wife insurance and she still felt bad. But the thing was, I wanted to go look at those books and I didn't want to like, like, oh, let me get all these books and all this and getting this free. I don't know, man. I don't know if, if she's up tomorrow with the yard sale. I'm going to go back and check out her books. She had a lot of books. I wanted the books. But anyway. From $9 for these three items went to $0. Promise you, man. Gave them to me for free. Uh, she felt bad about the insurance, which I told her I'm not even at the job anymore. Um, I told her I have insurance. And, you know, hey, I, I thank you. That's all I can say, man. Thank you. And then um, I think I made up for it for buying an ice cream maker, you know, four bucks. Anyway, um, that was it, man. It was three yard sales. One was the Heelys. That was a dud. Um, two was the joy, the joysticks and the toys. And the three was the ice cream maker, man. So three yard sales in my area. Um, I would have went out to more, but I had to get back because let me see, hold on. Shipment for orders. Okay. My shipment's on the way. So anyway, um, some other stuff. Anyway, I got some shipping to do. Um, I got about four sales going out. I sold a couple of more things. Um, I want to show you guys what I sold real quick, man. Now I posted this up. They're come the persons are on their way right now. They just text me they're on their way. It's actually two different people and locally. Now I made this mask inspired by Nipsey Hustle. You know what I'm saying? Hustle and motivate. Can you guys see that? Hustle and motivate. Um I did a different script because I like the script better. I think it's like a western type script, but um I spelled it like Nipsey Hustle spells it, hustle and motivate. Um I even got my own personal mask made. And then I did this one right here. It's the Punisher skull with the blue line. Uh, Bitto mask. I posted them up on offer up for ten dollars each. Um, I just got the messages from two people at the same time. One lives in Corona. One lives right here in Eastville. They're on their way to pick these up, so I'm gonna meet them over at my gate and everything. That's twenty bucks sold. I I'll take it all day. You know what I'm saying? Uh, ten dollars each, basically. And then I got about four Funko Pops to ship out. Two on Macari. Two on um, offer up. I mean, oh my goodness. Two on eBay. Um, they only sold for like 10, 10, and, or no, 12 and 12 on Morikari and 20 and 10 on eBay. It's a little mediocre sales. And then let me show you what else I did, man, like that. All right, shout out to my boy Junior, man. Um, just some shirts for him, man. I was working on them last night. We did like six masks, six black and six whites, and we got different shirts, man. We got some 5XLs in here, tank tops, that is, and then some regular tank tops, regular size tank tops and everything. Um or clothing line he's doing or promoting or something, man. Anyway, man, I appreciate the business. That was like a buck seventy-five, man. I'm just going to throw it out there, man. He don't ask for no discounts. He pays what he, what I ask and everything. You know what I'm saying? And you know, hey, it is what it is, man. I appreciate it, man. So money was made today. I'm getting ready to ship that off to Vegas. And um, I'm not even going to show you my mess over here. But anyway, we got all this going out, man. I got the mask going out. We got everything going out. So anyway, I'm up. Got to get to work, man. Got to do a lot of shipping, man. Make sure you subscribe. Like this video. Make sure you share it. Do what you got to do, man. Support your boy, man. Don't forget, if you're watching this video to the end, we're going to give away a gift card at the end of the month. Uh, maybe a $25 gift card. Maybe a $50 gift card. But it's going to be a gift card. But to where, I don't know. 
So make sure you subscribe, share the video, tell a friend, tell your mama, tell your baby daddy, whoever. All right? And we out. Peace.